let me show you whereabouts we are there's Nissi Avenue and if you go down there you'll end up in the middle of Ayanapa and the harbour also guys if you go down there turn right at the hotel you can reach the beach which is where the Dome Hotel is it's not too far away so that's where we are at Ayanapa and we're going to visit Macronus's village right let's go and have a look at some of these village buildings shall we now they've got a mixture of two story buildings there's one there with massive verandas at the top and then verandas on the bottom and bungalows let's go up through the arch there we are there's the bungalows also massive verandas and kind of their own garden in a way see they've got all the grass round here on the front and where the gardens are here we've got lots of olive trees everywhere it's lovely isn't it and it's very very quiet round here right there's some more of those bungalows it looks like they're cleaning out some of the rooms look there's housekeeping look at these lovely plants everywhere gardens everywhere now there is a volleyball court down there look that's got lovely sand around it it's nice and soft so let's go down towards the volleyball court Oh look guys, there's a football pitch as well, how about that? Lovely green grass. So you can have a stroll around this place guys in the evening or even during the day. It's a lovely day for a stroll. If you like uh, bird watching, there's lots and lots of birds around here. Last time I was here guys, beginning of the season last year, you could hear all the birds singing there's some more of those two-story buildings here you see oh. oh now this way right let's go down these little paths down here we can see some more of these bungalows i like the colors look at these lovely terracotta colors conifers on my left and lots of topiary lot of birds everywhere and it's beautiful let's go towards the right and then we'll come across the kids playground got a big playground in this area oh Oh, there's a big lizard over there. See if we can get near it. It's massive, isn't it? Look at that. There we are. See if we can get... Oh, oh, it's gone. Join his friend round the corner. Oh no, his friend scattered off. There he's gone up there. Okay, we won't scare him. There he is, lizard friend. Right, let's carry on. Oh, hello. 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 Oh, hello. hello. Uh, I've got my camera going. Oh, that's all right. You've been watching Cypress Insight, have you guys? And, and you've tour on this on this place here. We've yeah. come to do a tour again. Oh, this is a whole family here. Yeah. Excellent. You enjoying yourselves? Yeah, yeah. yeah. lovely. Let's take your name. It's our first day to today. We we are the White family. <laughs> oh, there you are. <laughs> Right, let's carry on. Oh, there we are. Some viewers are staying here. They really like it. They're off to Nissi Beach, which is not too far. They're going to have a stroll. Now, there's the kids' playground. As I said, we're coming up to the kids' playground, and there it is. There's lots of shade around here. Look, all the trees everywhere. So, ideal for the kids' playground.
signs everywhere guys so if you get lost in this village you can find your way around with all these signs everywhere looks like they've added some new play things right down there in the corner little sort of climbing frame thing so that's the park and then we'll go on to the restaurant it's a poolside restaurant oh that's it feed the grass it looks like we're gonna get wet very quick 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 it's coming round yeah I missed it how about that missed the sprinklers oh, the swimming pool is massive guys and I'm gonna walk around the swimming pool first of all I'll show you the restaurant there it is as I said it's a poolside restaurant there's the buffet area at the back quite a big buffet area lovely and cool around here so you've got their seating inside or out here in the veranda it's up to you guys then we've got the pool bar itself with some pool tables one minute they're doing uh, buffets tonight look there's the buffet and we've got some prices 15 euros or 10 euros for the children for the Mexican buffet tonight how about this one on Sunday they're offering a pork or chicken souffle which is a barbecue 14 euros 50 a person so there you are you can have something to eat here also they've got a, a lunchtime menu as well there we are or if you don't fancy what's going on here on the special offer boards there's loads to choose from mixed grill is 23 euros like a platter got cold starters up there eight euros so lots and lots of food to choose from guys if you fancy eating here chicken dishes down there look loads of chicken dishes so a vast amount of food oh look guys happy hour between four and six there's the happy hour menu look they're three euros fifty for your cocktails mm -hmm. 3 euros 50 cocktails in happy hour sounds very good value now there's this second part guys here which is the pool bar and the entertainment area there's the stage over there look and there's a kids area as well it looks like we've got sports playing on the pool bar tv right in the corner down there right i'm gonna go uh through both pools guys so we can see both pools at the same time let's go through here you see we've got the kids pool on my right which is quite a big kids pool and then on my left is this massive central pool you see it's also got an island and a nice bridge you can go over and i think there's a little cool down jacuzzi area down there we'll go past there in a minute as we go through the gardens first i want to go around this roundabout a human roundabout not a car roundabout <laughs> oh I'm going the wrong way yeah but it's a human roundabout yeah, yes so a slow beer here the crew's just checked it's four euros for the pint very reasonable for a slow beer so off each side of the roundabout are pathways to more bungalows and three-storey buildings at the back more gardens everywhere this is remnants of a water mill there we are that would have been bringing water up from some sort of well 
There we are. We've got another three-storey building down there. They're everywhere, guys. All scattered around these beautiful gardens. So we continue round the roundabout, and then we can go off at this junction here, past the other side of this vast swimming pool. Lots of umbrellas and some beds to choose from. So what we've got here guys, getting the pool, you, it's a couple little steps to get into the pool. Not too bad at all. And then a gentle slope. So we'll go around, oh no, sprinklers. Um, I'm going left. So you may get attacked by some sprinklers. You've got to be careful. Let's go around this way. I want to get attacked by sprinklers. There's the jacuzzi area I mentioned earlier. Look, quite nice, isn't it? Places to sit round. Conveniently located benches and the jets are all the way round. Nice jacuzzi area, that. Oh. Um, I was going to go down there, but there's water yeah let's go through it's a hot day today we'll get a bit wet there we are past the sprinklers oh that wasn't too bad we got away with that one there we go oops no we didn't just got wet well, as i said it's a lovely area you could stroll around in the evening or go left and what I'm going to do guys, I'm going to go right, follow the signs for the mini market. Oops, gardeners let me pass, thank you. Morning. What a nice gardener. Bet he's enjoying his job, isn't he guys? And then if I go straight, we came in left. But we're going to go straight this time. We'll find the reception area and the big car park there we are I told you you can hear the birds didn't I right so if we go down here we can see the car park area and I'm going to go have a look at reception show you what's going on there and I do believe there's a little bar at reception too right there's a vast car park area on my right so plenty of parking for your hire car or your quaddy bikes oh look at that now that is an old fork seen some gardening Must be 50, 60 year old folk. Look at those lovely conifers. What about that garden? Really beautiful. There, there's a little area you can have a slow beer just near reception here on this terrace. The reception's got its own building, dedicated reception building. There's a gentle slope going up to reception, or do like a slope up with the slope. So there we are guys, now there's ramps for trolleys and wheelchair use only. Oh, I do like a slope just walking up it. Now there are trolleys guys down here, there they are. So if you parked out there or in the car park, you can pick up one of these trolleys and put all your bits and pieces on and take it to your little bungalow. 
Oh, here we are, lovely cool reception area. There's the bar, and that's what I mentioned to you guys. You can go out there in the terrace and have a slow beer from this bar here, or sit in this lovely cool reception and enjoy free internet. Conveniently located, comfortable chairs everywhere. I do like these, they are beautiful, aren't they? And there's a little internet cuff as well, right in the corner. Oh look, there's a spa. Look at this. Massage, sauna, restroom, shower. Let's just go down and have a look. So there's the gym, guys. Look, lots of machines you can go on, up and down and round and round. Circular, up and down this particular one lift yourself up there if you can or running so lots of bits and pieces you can use and there's the sauna look oh looks like a nice sauna guys mm. there is your lovely spa room where you can have a nice massage so 65 euros guys for 50 minutes for a nice massage and there's other treatments as well just ask upstairs oh there's some evening entertainment going on parrot show some more from the spa look 40 euros for back massage for half an hour or 69 euros for 60 minutes. How are you? Wow. Right, let's go out this way, guys. So, Donna, let's go down to the end again to Nissi Avenue and we can show you where Macronis's beach is probably a five to ten minute stroll that's a stroll guys not running or fast walking now you can see the white hotel there amethyst hotel just turn right down there and you can see the dome hotel and there's Macronis's beach not too far away at all so guys, I hope you enjoyed this beautiful village. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And if there's somewhere you'd like me to go, put it in the comments below.